has got to be it. One, two, three. And Kofi retains. What the fuck was that? Look how small it was. Oh hell the fuck no you're not talking in my face. Last week. I'll bet Seamus hopes they don't actually continue from there. I mean, the last Ow. time we saw him, the real Survivor Series partner, Edge, spit right into a crate. Uh. Oh no! Uh. Devastating shot to the uh. spine and back. Yeah. Back at bragging rights, King. I can't help but wonder if Team SmackDown sealed their own fate the oh. way they treated Wade Barrett. Well, I don't think so. I mean, Ow. Wade Barrett loves hey, to be in the middle of controversy. We saw it with Nexus. Sure. We're seeing it again. And he's just playing Swift. Bitch. 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 has to be shooting through his face. Bitch, 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 bitch. Bitch, 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 bitch. bitch. Look at the good news, Del Rio. All the ladies love men who drink through straws. Pretty badass. Bitch, 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 bitch. As we stated at the start of the show, it shows them that you know how to drink their own sexual liquids. There's a whole host of title matches. King, what does that mean in particular to Sheamus? Well, for Sheamus, we know he wants nothing more than to go after John Cena and his World Heavyweight Championship. He's been after that for months. Sheamus knows how close he is, and with his track record, I'd imagine he'd do anything to win. Into that point, King. Bitch, bitch, the same thing bitch, you said about bitch, Edge, bitch, 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 the big screen. And Del Rio? Absolutely. Showing his pain Everybody in double in this match, save for maybe Big Show, cannot be trusted. He's got it locked in. Will this be it? Watch it. What strength. Fighting his way out. Countered by Sheamus. Wait a minute, All and right, yeah, we, uh, What an amazing display of power. He sees it. Blue kick. Sheamus with a wicked boot. One, two, three. No, uh, oh my Jesus. god, you bastard. That would be it. Youth resiliency, some bitch. Uh -oh. This is bad. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with him, man. And this has gotta be game. in. One, two, three, three. Sheamus wins. Welcome to Monday Night Raw, live from St. Louis, Missouri. Michael Cole and the Hall of Famer Jerry the King Lawler joining you from ringside and King. As you can see, tonight should be interesting. <laughs> well, last week, Sheamus was attacked in the back by Edge, Alberto Del Rio, and Jack Swagger. And now tonight, he and Barrett have to face Swagger and Big Show. When you're the size of the world's largest athlete, you don't need to attack anyone from behind.
So oh God, I gotta show, see the plan. Anyway, yeah, right. King, do you think this match will be a prequel of things to come in Survivor Series? Thankfully, uh, Big Show doesn't no. really I mean, that's a four on four match. Uh, Half of the competitors so aren't here right now. Getting him so and fucking him up is not the one Survivor Series. Uh, that and the number one contender but, spots. Uh, he can. Uh, Absolutely, but, uh, that's a game changer. Right he has itself. a lot of good ability, so. And the worst part about it is all he needs in this game is, at least I can't kind of shit. All he need, all he needs is one Ooh, mistake, and um, all you need is like one mistake. And how many times are you gonna be hitting this motherfucker before he actually goes down? You have plenty of chances. It's kind of one of your attacks, and then you kind of one of your attacks, you get fucked up. Partially, so you so want to go out with offense that puts you in the least risk of danger. Unfortunately. Survivor Series. Oh, boy. Thankfully, Barrett and Seamus have ring escape, so if you ever get, if you ever feel like you're about to be you can always just run out of the room. Delivered to the back. Uh, yeah. Oh, geez, lights out. Oh, look at this. Big Show said that these four men were going to have some fun tonight. But from the looks of things, Jack Swagger. Hey, I'll do it in front of the rap space. Well, to be fair, I'm not sure if Jack that, Swagger that. enjoys much of anything. Oh, my, another thunderous move. Bitch. 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 You might have wasted you and your team. This is trouble. Very massive sounds here. Swagger, shoulder first. Yeah, but look where he is. Oh man, watch Big Show. Show slam. Sheamus and Barrett are out. But it looks like Big Show had a good time tonight. And if Sheamus and his cohorts want to have any fun at Survivor Series, then Three. they'll need some way to Three. stop the world's largest athlete. And welcome to Monday Night Raw. Can you believe it, King? We are just a mere six days from Survivor Series. Well, Survivor Series has been around for over 20 years, and it's given us so many great moments. But I have a feeling that this year's Survivor Series may be the best of them all. Speaking of great moments, we've got a ton of great moments in store tonight. For example, in the main event tonight, it'll be Triple H and John Cena. Teaming up to take on Undertaker and Randy Orton. Uh, but starting things off, it'll be Jack Swagger and the incomparable R-Truth. Well, thankfully these guys learned from their mistakes and decided to do something about Big Show. The gentlemen are down the hall. We have work to do. There's a 500 pound monster coming this way, gentlemen. And I'm of the opinion that he doesn't make it out of this garage in one piece. I like it. Barrett and I can handle this fella. You two see that we're left alone. So 
so then he says, hey, hit my phone. Before we get started, I wanted to let you know this is going to hurt you a lot more than it does us. Alright, so your objective is to kick Big Show's ass. However, unlike when you had to face... You motherfucker. Not today. Huh. However, unlike when you had to face Edge and, uh, uh Josh Swagger and Alberto Del Rio, you have Wade Barrett to help you, kind of. You can't do that to uh, me. My motherfucker really fucked me up, I'll say that. <laughs> Who's it hurting now? So now thankfully Wade Barrett is out of the way, but you're unfortunately you do pay a bigger prey on him. That would kill somebody. So now like I was saying, they need to wear big show down. Oh, fuck no. Oh, God, I can't get there in the car. And now, WWE presents Survivor Series. In a showdown, a month in the making, is finally here. And how about the stipulation? Whichever team wins, each member will earn a number one contender match. Hey, Ken. Here comes William Regal. Yeah, but Michael, I don't think he's suited up. King, I, I, I think he's coming over here to join us on commentary. What? There's the bell, and this match is underway. Now, sir, and now that we have a big show to not worry about, we only have the weekend at Jack Swagger out for the Somebody else that sees years. things my way. Gentlemen. Yeah. Do you realize that right now oh you're watching the greatest collection of young talent in the WWE today? I realize now that your countrymen are all ass. amazing athletes, Mr. Regal. Get a you ask, that gold in your pants? What happened to Big Show? Just watching you trying to get at gold. But myself and any members so, of the team. So, I gotta say, man, I thought when really bad what Big Show's going to get fired and then you go and race. sitting in a car at an intersection where you can stop sergeants on every. Most of How should I know? They don't like Mr. Regal, what's your take like, on Valentine? Like like I don't like this man. He's going to get it in his head. I don't really give a shit about that. I don't think I'm going to get it in his head. I believe in equality. Everybody is equal. American and everybody else is the blood of the people. Regardless, man, I gotta say. That was a that was pretty stupid question, man. Michael. Oh, bitch ass punk going to go and. Like, when you're really better than everybody else, why are you gonna fucking cry like a little baby and eat your ass fucking slap? I guess maybe he was thinking, there's no way in hell this motherfucker was going to slap me. What the fuck? Yo. 
Drew McIntyre, pay attention. There we go. Earlier, you referred to this team by a name. What did you call them again? <laughs> Sorry, buddy, but I don't think we should know right now that we do not play fair. If you would wave Barry Kent, punch you in your mouth, it would punch you in Pride and dignity is the men in that ring and myself. In fact, I would appreciate if you refer to all members by a title more fitting of our pedigree. Bitch, bitch, Enough of this, bitch. Mr. Regal. Going forward, you shall refer to me as Lord Regal. That suplex was picture perfect. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Did he capitalize? Get your ass up. Get your ass up, Alberto. Uh-oh. Drew's got the arms Whoa. right down the neck. Rolling out of harm's way. Walker. Smart strategy there. And there's the... What diabolical things are going through that mind right now? When you get in control like this, you want to throw every... Will it be? Ref, count. Ref, fucking count. One, two, three. Watch it. And Swagger blocks it. Swagger, you can't tag it. And he targets the arm. Drew McIntyre's going up. Incoming. And the thing is worse, and I still hit the fucking head. And that one hurt his hand! Oh. And he's toast! Oh. Do you look for the moment of edge carrying there on the apron? That ragamuffin doesn't know what he's got himself into. That may be, but at least he's on the apron. What's your tone, Cole? Oh. At least I teach you a lesson in respect. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Oh my god! Oh, I gotta no. admit though, man, I don't like what they did with Jack. I don't like what they did with Drew McIntyre. Um, and uh, Bruce Slater and Jimmy Mahal. They made them superstars that were big when they started. They were like look a at bunch this, of fucking look at this! Now. While they were stars when they started, so, like stuff like that's not gonna happen to Luke Harper or. Seth Rollins. Like, the reason that won't happen to Luke Harper or Seth Rollins is because those guys were big. They worked in the independent circuit before they joined WWE. The potential of that happening to them were very, very slim. And like Dean Ambrose and maybe even Roman Reigns. Well, Roman Reigns can still be considered a nobody. But he's more like Justin Gabriel. He's a Generation 2 superstar, but. Like I said, though, man, like, it's all about, like, they'll, they'll probably either continue to be really good to confirm them that they're like, nobody. Anyways, the point of the matter is, you got people like Seth Rollins and Nick Clapper who worked in the independent circuit and had a very slim chance of, like, oh, becoming, like, Jaw, uh, awesome Drew McIntyre. But, oh, um, it's possible. Anyways, uh, like, that's enough of me talking about how that's going that's when it just uh broke up and it's up more after. Devastating damage to the upper vertebrae. And here's a cover. One, One two, two, three. three. Edge doesn't look like he wants any part of this. Well, it doesn't matter what Edge wants. This man's about to get the fashion of his life. Oh, my. Talk about your miracles. Boy, that's one angry-looking giant. This is impossible. He can't participate. The match is nearly over. Not only is he going to participate, Lord Regal, but Big Show showing no hesitation. 
Oh, look out! Spear! A spear from the 485-pound Big Show! Three. Oh, there's no way Drew's getting up from that. And now Big Show's begging Sheamus to bring it. This is impossible. What do you mean? I mean, don't worry about what I mean. I mean what? Now, the action. Ah, man, I had my mic Sheamus. off and I was saying epic shit. Big move coming. Ah, Bobby! No! Oh, tremendously painful move to the spine. All right, let's finish this asshole off. Sheamus hoisting the mammoth Big Show to his feet. Bro kick, no! Big Show catches the boot. Sheamus goes down. Like a Barrett set flying. Oh, the Big Show's on a tear. And Regal goes flying off the apron. Bruce kick. Sheamus just knocked Big Show out. One, two, three. And now the only person keeping the United Kingdom from victory is Edge. Alright, you know, I got my mic Anyway, if I already knocked me out last round, the Red Cade pulled off my only uh, fail so far in this game. Alright, you want to be that hardcore booty that is from your nightmares. Rep, get out of the fucking way. Look, he's got a finisher. Out here. I wonder, does this game kind of still have um, fired up? With authority. Hey. I understand. What uh, the fuck is uh, the uh, 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 You uh, think about it, it's like one of the most overpowered buddies in the game. It allows you to fucking use the finish three different times. Oh god, no. Oh god, no, run. Oh gosh, the back. That could very well I mean, be just think about it. Three finishers, and you've only earned uh, one. One of them is just Big enough. Big move, Kelly. Ah, oh, how the heck do you get up from that? Oh, what the? Barrett Regal are down, but they still aren't moving. Bitch, 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 Edge may have the match well in hand here. Okay, 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 okay. Tommy! Get 
Hey, come to think of it, he's one of them tips for that. Fuck. He's one of them tips for that. Where is my mother going to be? Where is my mother going to be? What the? Oh, come on. Oh, what the? No. No. No, get the fuck out of here. Look at this. Bitch, 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 bitch. Arriba! Bitch, 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 bitch. Wow. Look at him. today Halloween. Edge on Lodi there. Maybe not just bitch, man. What the fuck? He's got evil intentions. What the hell? Rolling out of harm's way. Wait, Barrett, are you dead? <laughs> You've been knocked out the entire time. Oh no! Another oh, that's good. That's good. Good. good, but god damn. Seamus scoops Edge up, throws him over his shoulder. Edge is in trouble. Oh, what a counter from Edge! Edge grabs the legs. One, two, three. No, Seamus kicks out. And now he's thinking spear. And Seamus doesn't know where he is. Seamus is in serious jeopardy. Edge is calling for it. Seamus sidesteps. Oh, what a kick to the skull. Out of nowhere. One, two, three. The United Kingdom has, has done it. And now the entire WWE needs to, well, they need to watch their backs. live in the Big Easy, New Orleans, Louisiana. And listen to this reaction for John Cena. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the World Heavyweight Champion, John Cena. Now I gotta tell you, Michael, John Cena has to be gearing himself up for one heck of a fight. The C Nation, 100% in the corner of John Cena. I'm going to remind you what it means to deal with the power of the Celtic warrior. Seamus, over here. It looks like you've also earned a shot against me for my United States Championship. Well, here's the thing. I'm not a patient man. If I have to face you, i just as soon do this tonight. I can see you're not too keen on the idea. But the thing is, I am. So don't move an inch, Seamus. I'll be right there. Kofi Kingston is you just signed your deathbed, Kofi Kingston. No, but fuck that's right he was focused on facing Cena at TLC not Kofi tonight and two Sheamus went through a grueling battle last night in the Survivor Series so there's no way he's 100% in this shot at the United States Champion this is all true but King I think there could be an intent 
tangible at play here. Sheamus has been riding a wave of momentum over the last yeah, several months. So as small as you are, I'm surprised to see if that plays a factor in this match. You guys have got to leave now. What the fuck was that? Look how small it was! Kofi Kingston is intent on slowing the roll of the Celtic Warrior and is willing to put his United States Championship on the line to do it. I like this strategy by Kofi for two reasons. Motherfucker, asshole, piece of shit! He was focused you killed Interfere! With Marco. This is all true, but King, I think there could be an intangible at play here. Sheamus is the guy who ran the momentum over the last several months. I wouldn't be at all surprised to see if that plays a factor in this match. Took the world backbreaker. He catches them with the X handle. You gonna put them now, Kobe? Now, Sheamus. Vintage Sheamus. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. One. Two. And there's the kick out by Kingston. The yeah, kick out of this. To the jaw. What the? Yo, what the hell? I don't think so, Kobe. Shoulders down. One. One. Two. two. Sheamus wins. Oh, I'll win, motherfucker. Sheamus is the next winner of his chance. Sheamus is the new United States champion. Oh, this isn't good, Michael. I have a bad feeling about what lies ahead in TLC. Maybe he won't be. The rest of the WWE is to be on the high alert. He's not as big as his ears. comes to you live in Tulsa, Oklahoma. And King, the WWE is on its heels as the United Kingdom begins to gain ground in its quest for gold. And speaking of the United Kingdom, here they come. Ladies, Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen Wade, Wade Barrett, Barrett William, William Regal, Regal, Drew McIntyre, and the United and States, States champion, champion Sheamus, the United Kingdom. Last week it was John Cena that came out first, and this week it's the United Kingdom. And boy, can you hear the difference in the reaction by these fans? Will you simpletons please show some respect? You're in the presence of the new United States Champion. Lord McIntyre, I'm afraid we expected this. You see, Americans have no respect for themselves. Respect for each other. So why should have any respect for their United States champion? They just don't have any respect for you guys. Very true, Lord Sheamus. And with that kind of attitude, why would anybody want to be champion of these United States? For that very reason. I have retired the championship of one worthless country. And I'm reinstating the championship of the world's greatest continent. I hereby declare myself the European champion.
yourself European champion? What gives you the right to declare anything? In fact, what gives you the right to disrespect these people and this country? If you want respect, you gotta earn it. And as far as I can tell, you boys have been cheating your way to the top. The TLC, I would need to cheat to beat you. Well, that would I didn't agree to that! Well, you didn't agree to this either. Drew, you, and Sheamus have a match right now against me and this guy. After trashing the United States, Sheamus and Drew are fucked up now. Against John Cena and Rey Mysterio. And would you look at this? Seamus and McIntyre. You bitch. Don't even break it up. I will break up when you're kicking me. everybody and welcome to Friday Night Smackdown. You can almost smell the turkey cooking king. Well, 
I don't know anything about turkey, but I do smell a goose that's about to get cooked, and that's a big goose known as the United Kingdom. The United Kingdom has earned several championship matches for TLC. One of those matches will pit Wade Barrett against the WWE Champion, Undertaker. Yeah, and if Undertaker destroys Wade Barrett, I'll have plenty to be thankful for. All right. Undertaker has to be around here somewhere. This is where we're going to make our big mistake. No one fucks with the dead man. I wonder, why did they got the WWE Championship? Where did he go? Right behind you, idiot. Alright, now you gotta kick Undertaker's ass. Or at least try to. Let's dance, fella. Bitch. This door is perfect for your face. This door in your face were meant to be. Bitch. This is wrestling you grapple. So Vodka believes it's a very punchy business. Ow. No way, I will not have this door doing that. This door is meant for you, not for me. You have committed adultery, Undertaker. The door was cheating on you and was with somebody else. And you're very proud of it. Bitch. Bitch. The locker room is a very dangerous place. Then we can put it this. If he did the tombstone in here, even though they know how to land the shit, but this is not a very safe place to even remotely be out. You can't beat me! Bitch. We want to see you in the ring, now! Well, this is unexpected. Apparently, Sheamus and Wade Barrett attacked Undertaker, and now Kane and Undertaker have challenged them to a match. Well, I think the United Kingdom have finally bit off more than they can chew. What do the Brothers of Destruction have in store for the United Kingdom? We find out next. I and now Kane interferes, and I don't know how to come to my friends, but now that Kane has interfered, we have to face him and his brother. And a chance. There you go. We don't fuck with the monsters. Oh no! Tilt the world backbreaker! Intercepted. Oh, God, no. Well, that'll send you to the chiropractor. Oh, get the fuck back here. I ain't done with you yet. Look at Kane pointing at his brother. Yo, brother, kick this freaking ass. What's the matter with me? I ain't saving you this time. I got you this boy. No, it's up to you. Bitch, 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 bitch. Bitch, 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 bitch. Look at this, look at this. Big move coming. Wow, what a suplex. Oh, no, no, I can't. A nice reversal by The Undertaker. Yow! The sound of human flesh on the ground echoes around the arena. 
Look at this. Look at this. Just think, Michael. Not only will Undertaker's WWE Championship be on the line at TLC, but so will all the other championships. Right now, we're watching Sheamus in Barrett. But the United Kingdom courts, Regal and McIntyre, will face Ezekiel Jackson and Christian in a tag team table elimination match at TLC for the WWE tag team titles. No way, Goodbye. This could do it. Oh, no! Ring the bell. Sheamus and Barrett have had enough of Kane and Undertaker. Well, they might be able to run away tonight, but in two weeks at TLC, there'll be no place to go. Welcome back to Monday Night Raw, and what a match we have lined up next. Well, I know Regal and McIntyre have been naughty this year, but I must have done something nice, because I get to see Divas. And that's right, this Sunday at TLC, William Regal and Drew McIntyre will face Ezekiel Jackson and Christian for the WWE Tag Team titles. And Layla will face Natalya for her Divas Championship. So up next, all six of these competitors will face off in a mixed tag team match. Well, King, I guess your holiday wishes came true. The ladies will be starting this to have off a bit of the fun. King, what's that over your head? What's well, mistletoe, of course. Come on, Natalia. Throw Layla over this way. Oh, man. He landed right on his neck from that German suplex. so crafty and cagey he can hurt you in so many ways wow what a super first time the player to drop you on the head game oh dear well your regal knows how to make even the simplest move more devastating now in this match we can make tag team match and you tag in another one of your members they will be forced to tag in one of them not hold that against her oh come on king you're telling me you don't like anyone from britain or ireland even if they're like knocked the out, it's well, just this group, the United, United Kingdom. Kingdom. I've had enough to hear with their arrogance and conceit for anything. Well, anything non-British. Layla, like, get the football off. William the Regal to the top. No, William, no, 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 tag in Layla, tag in Layla, tag in Layla. The tag is me. All right, now Layla's tagged in, I can tag back in real, that that would not tell you real. I'm gonna tell you, you go and get your partners in, I'm not done with them yet. You're not even gonna be competing with this guy, Like I was saying about next guy coming up. Now, if the opponents, you can still pin the opponent with the Divas until I think, like, what was it, 14 or 13? Um, anyway, that's what I'm saying. You can still pin the, uh, pin the Divas or the Nails. Uh, and, uh, I don't know about, whatever I'm saying, anyways. Like I was saying, though, um, now I get this. The women can hit the men, but the men can't hit the women at all, or it's automatic disqualification. Anyways, like I'm saying. Might not know where he is right now. So, I'm sure you can already guess what I'm going to do. Whatever you can, whatever you can. Wait to see you. In six days, these competitors will face each other again at TLC. And on that night, Michael, consider me pro-Canadian. <laughs> Oh, oh, you dirty bastard! <laughs> oh, God. You see that shit? Oh, that can't feel good. Oh, out of nowhere! Get out of here! I ain't done with you yet. I ain't nearly done with you yet. Huh? Oh, gosh, right down on the kidneys. Oh, 
He's begging for it. Uh-oh. Drew's got the arms. Oh, brutal impact. Oh, yeah. get back on the apron. Now, the unlike other Dragon Beaver Sag Team matches, if you try to pin the opponent, Shoulders they'll get down. on the ring. But in this match, One, it's different. Two, three. <laughs> so I get to pin Christian's ass with a really good laser. It has come down to this. Sheamus is obsessed. Oh, are you obsessed with you don't fuck up now. Oh, buddy. John Cena is that. the only person left to so, stop him. So, weapons in this game do a ton of damage. I don't know if they do a ton of damage. They do knock them out. Championship it has to offer. Yeah. I had to Ouch. He's going to be bruised from head to toe before this one's over. And again, the ladder comes into play. My favorite weapon in the game? Well, besides you. What up? Let me knock John Cena out. I'll get my favorite weapon. Oh no! Oh my gosh! I thought it was oh god, no! Oh, now climbing one rung of the ladder at a time. Oh, directly on that table. He's getting ready to use that ladder again. Oh! Kid, did you see that? Oh man, it doesn't get much closer than that. And again, he gets struck with that object. Oh man, right on the button. And Cena goes down. What the hell? How do you not go down from that? What's he planning here? Well, let's get my favorite weapon. We know this as Sharif's wife. Or at least she does her job well. Oh, I had a good What do you think it'll mean to him if he wins it? Well, in that sick mind of Sheamus, I wouldn't be at all surprised if he treated that holding of that title as being ruler of the No, 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 no. Grab him. Grab him, bitch. Cena's here to stop him. And there's that bell again. Oh, you heard the impact. Devastating shot with the bell. Ring bell right to the gut. And now, oh no, what a devastating hit to the back of the skull. The rock, motherfucker. The rock always used this. And now, Sheamus, vintage Sheamus. It's nap nap time for you, Cena. Thunderous impact on the concrete floor. And he might be ringing that bell one more time. What should Cena be looking for now? Take your time. This action has gotten completely out of control. Hear it? Oh my gosh, he stopped it. Man, I thought it was done for. Ow. Sheamus, no! Cena's got him. Cena, going for the attitude adjustment. Sheamus has the ropes. Oh my, Cena delivers an attitude adjustment over the top rope. Yeah, but did you see the way Sheamus landed? It looked like he blocked some of the impact. Well, it doesn't matter, because Cena's going up. Cena's going to win. Wait, look at Sheamus. Look at Sheamus. Oh, man, this is awful. No, he can't. He did. High cross. And John Cena landed with a sickening thud outside the ring.
I don't believe this. How did this happen? King, the United Kingdom has won every title in WWE. WWE. one of the most infamous nights in WWE history. We welcome you live to Monday Night Raw in Miami, Florida. Michael Cole and Jerry the King Lawler at ringside. It was an historic night for this band of, well, I guess we have to call them champions now, the United Kingdom. Yeah, never in my life have I seen a group just dominate the way the United Kingdom did last night. Say what you will, but you have to give them credit. And now, King, they hold all the gold. Before you is every champion in WWE today. You see, when a man or woman from Great Britain puts their mind to a task, it gets accomplished. I've been in this industry long enough to see many groups come and go. The Generation X, Evolution, the Four Horsemen, the men that formed those factions were all outstanding. as it once was. Did you just say your group, the United Kingdom, has been around for the length of a sneeze, is superior to the Four Horsemen, a group that dominated for 20 years? Did I hear that right? That's exactly what he said. Drew, you talk out of turn again, I'll come down there and take you over my knee. Do you understand? Look here, you dinosaur. If you don't think the United Kingdom is better than the Horsemen, and we can find out right now. Look, Seamus, my competitive days are over. But if you're feeling frisky, I think some can be arranged. Now, just a sec. Let me think. Have it. John Cena told me just a couple of minutes ago that he doesn't want to wait until more around. You think you want, motherfucker? What you gonna fear in my life? What you gonna fear in my life, bitch? I'm sure his New Year's resolution is to win that championship back. If there's anybody that can dig down deep and do it, it's John. But he's still a man. Why is your technique so fucking hot? Why did you miss that shit? So many Kingdom. questions need to be answered. And the knuckles connect. Oh, look at this. What the fuck? Oh my god. Fuck you, Cena. Fuck you so hard, I do. Oh, but your mommy last out. night too, hey, sir. Yeah, yeah no, move fuck you. Coming. And a huge move on the outside. Two. 
Gotcha. Another huge suplex. Watch it. Warrior time. The United Kingdom described themselves as the greatest group to ever compete in our industry. What do you make of that, Ken? Huh. Well, these guys are good, but like Arn said, they need to be around for a little longer than a month before they can claim that accolade. Cena just one heartbeat quicker on that exchange. And there's the belly-to-belly -belly suplex. Oh, fuck, Wait a minute, and now Sheamus, vintage Sheamus. Buddy, that's pushy, uh, so. uh oh he's in position, ready to strike. Oh, no! Look at the strength of this guy. Here, bitch. High cross. Sheamus launched him at least 10 feet. Okay, what should Cena be looking for now? Sheamus going for high cross. But Cena counters. Ooh. STF. STF locked in. Sheamus hit the ref. Was that accidental? Oh, I doubt it. Here comes McIntyre. Wait a minute. It's Arn Anderson. Ooh. DDT. McIntyre skull first. Cena. Cena's gonna win. Attitude uh. adjustment. One, two, three, no. McIntyre breaks it up. How close was Cena? Uh. And the ref has no choice but to disqualify Sheamus.